MCTV is on the air. Legend is Exodus, searching for euphoria, stretching through the mud to find the present, no ignoring us. Got 20,000 deep up in the street like we some warriors. My mama told me never bow your head. Whoa. I feel glorious, glorious, got a chance to start again. I was born for this, born for this. So I am a good of again. Standing by live at our Brooklyn County. Good morning, Huskies. Weather-wise, it's looking like a nice fall day with a slight breeze and a high of 68 degrees. And there's no DJ of the day today due to PSAT testing. It's October 12th and day two of the six-day cycle. Please join us in rise for our national anthem and the Pledge to the Flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Positive Vibes t-shirt tie-dye day is back. Every student and all staff are encouraged to tie-dye a free Be Kind t-shirt Tuesday, October 18th, between 8 a.m. and 6.30 p.m. This is a super fun event and will be set up right here at the high school in the hallway outside the entrance to the gym. Plan to do your shirt after school, practice, or work. If you can't make it at all after school, you may visit the station during study hall, lunch, or with teacher permission only. Also, we encourage you to wear your t-shirts to the Neon Night football game on Friday, October 21st, where we will be raising awareness to reverse the stigma because mental health matters. Seniors, the Coca-Cola Scholarship is awarded to students in their final year of high school. The online application is open from now until October 31st. Seniors with an overall B average planning to pursue a degree at an accredited U.S. institution are encouraged to apply and should stop by the guidance office for additional information. Happy Halloween, spooky student body. MCHS Spirit Club is hosting the first annual Trunk or Tree on October 19th. Sign up with a group of your friends to decorate your car or a parking space to hand out candy or prizes to trick-or-treaters. Use the QR code or the tiny URL on the posters around the school to register your team. Hey, History Club members, our next History Club meeting will be coming on November 1st at 7.40 a.m. We'll be looking for you. The Senior Dinner Dance will be held on Saturday, November 12th from 6 to 10 p.m. in the MCHS Commons. Sign-ups are now underway and run through October 28th. Students that sign up someone from outside of MCHS will need a guest form. Cost of the dance is $25 per person. Please see Mr. Hopple or Ms. Gilbert with any questions. Attention students and staff. The school store is closed today and will remain closed until Mr. Monsell returns. But don't worry. Upon return, the fundraiser will resume and be extended beyond the 14th. As always, thanks for supporting the school store. Choir lessons for today are Period 4, Dana Ziders, Period 6, Morgan Grimm, Maggie Rodenbaugh, and Alexis Sellers. Attention students, your books are for sale now. You should be receiving an order form today in first period. Don't miss out on a free name stamp by ordering before November 1st. This is a $5 savings. Online ordering is also available at bell4.com. If you have fundraiser credit, you should not order online. The annual canned food drive continues. Please bring in your canned foods and non-perishables through November 10th and put them in the donations box in the kiosk area. Everything put in the boxes will be donated to Mother Hubbard's Cupboard. The two first periods with the most items donated will get a free breakfast. At last count, we in the media room are currently in first place with 31 cans. Mrs. Hart's class is second with 17. Girls Volleyball is in the dog pound tonight. Here's Asia with sports. Yesterday in MC Sports, despite 21 saves from goalie Sophie McCurdy, 
Our field hockey team was defeated by Cumberland Valley 3 to nothing. Our boys soccer team was shut out by Palmyra with a 9 to nothing final score. And on the road, our girls soccer team ended up tying Palmyra 3 to 3. The girls are now 6, 7 and 1 on the season. Today in MC Sports, the Husky volleyball team has their last home game and it's a gold out. Come out and support Minithon and the team as they face Palmyra. There will be raffle baskets and all proceeds go to Minithon. JV starts at 5 with varsity to follow. Attention MC Mat Men. Anyone who wrestles or is interested in trying wrestling, there are open mats in the high school mat room every Monday and Wednesday from 3.30 to 5 p.m. Contact Coach Martin with questions. Speaking of wrestling, hydration testing for wrestlers will be November 2nd, 3rd, 8th, 9th, and 15th. All testing will be done in the high school athletic training room. All wrestlers must sign up for a time slot. The sign-up link can be found on the athletics website. Please see Zach in the athletic training room if you have any questions. And also, attention wrestlers. There will be an informational meeting this Thursday at 2.30 p.m. in the auditorium. All wrestlers and interested wrestlers should attend the meeting. Thank you. MCHS Senior Student Athletes. The Heisman High School Scholarship application is open until October 18th. Male and female senior scholar athletes with high character are eligible to win $1,000 to $10,000 in scholarship money. Stop by the guidance for additional information. Let's look at Wednesday sports. Michaela, what's for lunch? In the Husky line, cowboy burger, onion rings, curly fries, sliced cucumbers, and milk. And in the griller, hamburger or breaded chicken sandwich. That's all for the morning show. For all of us here at MCTV, I'm Evan. And I'm Michaela. Have a wonderful Wednesday. Have a husky day.